Hello, it's Flo, and today I want to change the custom ROM for Fuano on the HTC Sensation XE. So this is the same uh, thing to do for the HTC Sensation and Sensation 4G. So the first thing is to unlock the bootloader. So you can see I have a phone uh, with factory reset there, uh, and this is a nice cream sandwich uh, version. So this is the Sensation XE, and we can go to About Phone and software information and you can see I have the uh, Android version 403 and the HTC Sense version 3.6 okay so uh, what I must do is to change the custom ROM and uh, what I want to say to you yes you must uh, unlock uh, yes you must go to settings uh, go to power and uncheck fastboot there and you must go to developer options excuse me there and you have to check USB debugging. Okay, when it's done, uh, I can say you have the version 1.29.000 for uh, the H boot, and you must solve that later. So let's go to uh, the website HTC Dev, the HTC uh, website, and you have to go to unlock bootloader right there and get started. There on the right side of your screen, you must select your, your phone, and this is the sensation, so right there, and begin unlock bootloader. Okay, now, um, flow, wolf, and my. Okay, submit. You are now logged in. Okay, and I have to select my device. There, and begin the unlock bootloader. Um, okay so are you sure yes and you have to follow different steps so let's go proceed to unlock okay i need to agree that and that uh, process to unlock instruction step one uh, remove and reinsert the battery uh, then proceed to step two okay uh, so let's go you have to just remove the battery uh, then select to start or dumb volume okay and device okay press down and pour okay yes you have just to remove the battery like that to do an hard reset so let's go to remove the battery okay then uh, we have to press it there we have to press and hold the power up button and the uh, volume down button like that and stay on the volume down your phone must start on the debugging mode like that so this is the uh, bootloader mode here we have the H boot 129 that I was speaking about just uh, just before. Okay, so step three we have to press on face fast boot. So to change on this menu, excuse me. Alright, okay. You have to press volume down or volume up to change there, and you have to press power to select it. So we have on we are on fast boot there. Okay. Uh, step four connect the device to the computer via a USB cable so we have to plug it there okay step 5 proceed to step 5 okay uh, on your computer create a new folder for example where we will be uh, patching free files the HBX HB uh, win AP, AP and okay uh, to find this file SGK manager wait about 3 minutes you will see there uh, you have to install the Android SDK okay um, and you have to go to the folder uh, which is this folder oh, okay I have the SDK manager and I must have a look in Android and tools there okay and I must have the uh, what are different files HBX fastboot X so I have HBX here HB win USB uh, AP there and the uh, fastboot there. This is for uh, unlock the bootloader and we must use it later. Okay, uh, when it's done you go to step 6 and you launch a command. So start and uh, run and cmg. I have a command prompt right there. Okay, step 7, navigate to where you unzip the file uh, and go to the folder you just create. Okay, sorry. Um, I will just show you that right there okay so please focus okay um, so let's go to see Android 
Uh, okay, so excuse me, CJ C on the read with out a capital slash watch this video. I don't remember. Okay, tools Android. Uh, okay, C Android SDK. Android SDK Windows okay and there I own an Android SDK uh, Windows so proceed to step 8 okay you have to uh, enter this command right there okay this one so let's go uh, fast no I have to go to uh, tools because this is untold okay Android SDK Windows Tools. Okay, and then first put g get in the gfr underscore token. Okay, so you have some times and you have an okay there. So this is okay for you. You will see a long block and uh, seven. Okay. Okay, you right click, mark, highlight block on the right copy. Okay, so you have to copy that. Please cut. Okay, so right click. Uh, no, right click. Select all. No, right click. Excuse me. Uh, select from there to there. I think. Yes. No. To, okay. There to there. And you have to right click. Right click. Excuse me. Okay. And click to copy okay so I click and it's copy you will see one of the following two screens okay uh, when copying uh, the token start with this line and end with this line uh, not only copy the island okay so pass this string of text into the token for field and it's submit in order to save your unlock code binary you will save okay so my device identifier token you have, excuse me yeah. you have to copy the text and Patch it there on my device identifier token. Okay, and you have to click to submit. Um, yes. Okay. Token submitted successfully. You have been sent an email with your unlock key. Uh, please review this email for further instruction. Okay, so let's go to my mail and just go to HTC unlocking. Attaching this email, you unlock bootloader. You have to download uh, the file attached. Okay, so download it. Okay, uh, to use this file to unlock your device, simply follow the remaining instruction of the website. Click here to continue the bootloading process. So let's go to uh, take the new bin file and patch it in the file created only for the for this uh, this auto. Okay, so let's go to HTC flow YouTube and sensation and files and I will catch it there and I have to change the name because I have the same for my HTC sensation uh, HTC one S. Okay, so when we have done that step 11 and the code save this file in the same folder as your but fast boot files. Okay, so this is a mistake for me uh, copy that and okay um, see SGK tools and cut it there okay unlock cut bin is on the uh, tools folder okay uh, if after a short uh, unlock a bit save is fine same folder for example in order to ensure that you're uh, okay so I have to enter a new command prompt this one okay uh, let's go to C G Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. Here is my mistake. Tools and first boot flash unlock token unlock underscore code dot bin and check enter. Okay, so you have something on your screen of the HTC sensation XE there. You have unlock bootloader and you have to click I think yes, I have just to to be sure there step 13 okay and you click there yes 
Yes, I know that. Okay, please. Yes, please. Oh yes, you have to select it with uh, the power with the volume button and press power to enter. There. Okay. Uh, okay, and your phone. Uh, and your phone will reboot and no modification will have been made. Okay, but you are now bootloader unlocked. And I am ready to show you how to S off your HTC Sensation XE. So my phone is just rebooting and let's go to a new O2. Thanks to have seen this video and see you on the next one.